Hey everyone and welcome. I am Sailor Drew and this is another episode of Let's Play Stardew Valley. And Donut is running around like a crazy lunatic. Got up early and made coffee. Uh, I love you. Okay, so you need to start coming to bed early and spend time with Elliot. So that is the goal. Uh, so Jojo picked us up last night uh, and got cashback rewards program from Pierre. Wow, a lot of mail today. Uh, battery packs. So Pam needs a battery, which I can totally do. Uh, so goblin problem. Yeah, we still gotta take care of that. So batteries. Uh, so gosh. Oh, something new to take to the, um, Museum. I also got like a lifetime supply of freaking <laughs> um, the fast grow. So, yeah, that's pretty awesome. So, I'm gonna just quickly take care of my chores, um, clean out my inventory. I'm curious as to see how far the stuff that I got will take me. Um, I mean, I seriously got a metric ton. 555. Like, wow. Uh, so I'm also going to put in all of the extra stuff that I need to sell to the, uh, the Adventures Guild guys because I've been kind of hoarding a bunch of rings and stuff in here. The vampire ring, I'm still not entirely sure what I'm going to do with that. Like, if I'm going to keep it or not. So, I'll just keep it in there with um, everything else that I kind of squirrel away. Uh, so, yeah. Ooh, 11 crows. Nice. You need a raise, dude. Yeah, I don't know. If this doesn't cover everything in my fields, I will be very, very surprised. But, I mean, you never know. So I have 142 left, not too shabby. Um, let's see here. I don't think I need my scythe or my watering can, but I do have some running around to do today. So I need to go out to the Adventures Guild, but I'm also going to drop off uh, this battery to Pam in the rain. <laughs> this is safe. Uh, so, hey, pull through with the battery pack. Thanks, kid. You're a lifesaver. All right. So, she gave us 400 gold for it. Not too shabby. I also want to go to Clint's and see if he will go ahead and upgrade my axe. I need to drop off that strange doll to Gunther as well. I need to keep an eye out for dig spots since it is raining. They do show up more often because, um, I don't know. I've never finished the museum before, so I'm really hoping that this time around I'll be able to do it. Oh, he says it doesn't seem like... What? But the question marks. The heck. Yeah, there is already one in here. Um, hmm. Well, I guess I can't donate it. I'm just gonna have to sell it for a thousand gold. Drat. Uh, so that's unfortunate. But no big deal, really, in the grand scheme of things, I suppose. Uh, sup, Clint? I got a job for you. Upgrade tools. Yep, that's the last 
that uh, tool that I need upgraded. And I'll head down to the ocean, see if there are any dig spots down there before I head up like to the mountainous area. Uh, sometime soon, I should be able to also uh, afford getting the final upgrade to the house to where I get a basement because, yeah, that definitely will help with the whole money-making scheme. Wow, look at all the arrows. <laughs> like, wow. Uh, ooh, ornamental fan. Oh, wow, look at all the stuff, too. Okay, yeah, so I need to take care of all this stuff out here. Uh, lots of coral today. Cool. Ooh, and sea urchins. Awesome. Okay. Oh, there's the mermaid. Glad the amulet worked out for you, miss. <laughs> I just still imagine her having, like, a super gruff voice, even though uh, she's a mermaid now, so. Uh, alright. So, let's dump everything in there ocean wise and go ahead and refill these and the recycling machines yeah putting the bait bucket out here was a pretty good idea I think just because I seem to be running out of bait more um, quickly than I can get it so and I don't necessarily want was that it just as oh uh Brand. Yeah, that was it for trash. And I d okay, yeah, I've got one pair of glasses in here. Um, okay, yeah, cool. Uh, yeah, because I don't want to use, like, the, the full-on, like, bug meat for breaking up into smaller pieces of bait. Just because you can make, like, really excellent bait with the full-fledged, like, stuff. So, yeah. Which eventually I do want to go and check and see, uh, seaweed for a taco. Okay, I can do that. I've got plenty of that. Um, but I forgot what I was going to say. I was derailed by the seaweed taco. Uh, but words, I don't know. It was something, <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, I'll figure it out later. Uh, okay, so go over to the quarry as well and take a look around because usually that has some dig spots. Uh, oh, Friday. I think the traveling merchant was actually supposed to be down there, so I... I don't know if I can rush down there though or not. Okay, so what is it that I was wanting the level, uh, the lava katana? Why? Oh, cause plus three defense. Yeah, cause see, even though the galaxy sword is 60 to 80, this is 55 to 64, which is a bit less. Ooh, and the weight, but plus 25 crit power and plus three defense. Yeah, so that's what, what I've been wanting. Oh, they've got a galaxy dagger and club. I'm not really good at clubs so dark boots plus four to defense plus two to immunity. Oh, okay yeah I've got the best boots. There are around um hmm skeleton mask short speed uh ruby plus ten attack Weapon speed, critical strike power. So really, I could instead of doing the Yoba ring, um, I could just get one of these that would like increase my attack or something. So I don't know. Uh, Ten percent doesn't really uh do a lot when it was just like fifty, like ten percent. Uh, eh, but I don't know. I'll think about it. Uh, okay, so... Slimes. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's an interesting number. Uh, dust sprites. I also need to finish up. Wow. Yeah, I've done most of them. So, dust sprites and slimes. 
which dust sprites will be good because I need to uh, go and mine a bunch of um, iron. So yeah, that'll have to happen. Traveling merchant. Oh god, she's open late. Thank you. God bless her. Okay, so she doesn't have what I need, though, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. Okay, well, at least we checked. Oh, and I can't even chop down these, like, little logs. Because I don't have my axe. Um, so what I'm going to do is, I guess I'll just run home and call it a night. Because there's nothing really else that I, you know, is super imperative to get done today. Uh, I need to probably sell these sunflowers. Unless I'm going to turn them into seeds, but I think I'll, um, just go ahead and sell them for the money. Uh, okay, so, <clears throat> pardon me, uh, yeah, go ahead and sell those, sell the fan. Oh, Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to, okay, yeah, I actually need to donate that one, um. Yeah, so I got like two pieces of stone today. Woo! <laughs> uh, Alright, yeah, I'm just going to call it a night. Because there's not really a reason to stay up. Plus, like I said, I'm going to be trying to uh, be going to bed a lot earlier. Just so I can get that prompt. Make some bibbies with Elliot. Hi, Elliot. You're ice cold. Let me keep you warm. Oh, I like it. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's go ahead and crank up the heat in here. Water the poor cactus that gets watered like once a blue moon. Uh, yeah, I think my next major purchase is going to be the furniture catalog. Really? I don't know. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Because the uh, furniture, ca well, I think Pierre's catalog is a lot cheaper, to be honest. I don't know. Plus, being able to, like, actually have our floors and everything look nice is, you know, would, would be nice. <laughs> Imagine that. Um, okay, so, oh, George. Maybe you can build with it or something. Awesome. Gus also needs seaweed. Which, I know I have seaweed somewhere. Maybe it's in here? Uh, okay, yeah, there we go. So, snag that. Oh, I didn't even check my fortune or anything. Uh, so, weather report. Storm is approaching. Fortune teller. Spirits are very happy today. Ah, uh, which is super tempting. It's always tempting whenever my luck is really good to go out to the Calico Desert. Wow, a lot of stuff came in today as well. Cool. At least it's always nice whenever everything kind of comes in at the same time. It just feels like super satisfying. Like, yes. I am a farmer. Dang it. <laughs> uh, it's getting late in the season though, so what I can grow is starting to become limited. I mean, I could have planted more pumpkins. But, oh, yeah, that's right, because I did. I I ran out of, um, uh, whatchamacallit. I ran out of seeds, so couldn't necessarily do it, I suppose. Uh, so let's check in here. Oh, there's, like, one plant ready. Cool. All right. So for now, I'll go ahead and put the fruit and the seeds in there. Uh, yeah, so... Maybe make some chrysalariums, provided that I have all of the materials. So let's see what I need. Gold, iridium, and battery packs. So gold, iridium, stone, and battery packs. Oh god. Uh, it's a good thing uh, uh, storms are coming. So I also need to replant everything. I might go out to Pierre's and get a bunch of, um, so six days, eight days. Yeah, it's going to have to be beads. 
beets cannot be beat right now as far as what I'm replanting. Um, so I need to go out to Pierre's and buy... Oh, stop trying to eat the eggplant. Oh, it's because I got it accidentally. <laughs> selected. I was like, why did she keep doing that? It's weird. Um, so seeds for wheat and uh, sunflower seeds for making oil because I need a lot of oil for cooking. So yeah. Okay, so let's uh oh I meant to grab the battery packs while I was up there. Snag these. Oh god, don't go out the gate. I left the gate open. No! Oh my god. Bad goat. Bad goat. Oh jeez, they're like stuck. Okay, yeah, yeah, get back in there. <laughs> I'm like, no trying to get out where all the grass and stuff is at though. Uh, so let's see. Drink the coffee so we can run faster. Check over here. Yeah, nothing else has come out uh, just yet. Ooh, maple syrup. Ooh, a lot of the syrup just came in. Nice. So yeah, if anything, I'm just going to be spending like a, an exorbitant amount of money today. But that's okay. I'm I'm doing pretty well in the money department as far as like um you know making it and stuff. <laughs> uh, so I should be able to kind of replenish um my any deficits that I give myself pretty quickly. So it's just kind of like getting into this like routine of everything. Definitely helps. So I'm gonna go ahead and sell all of that and those. Uh, melon wine, yeah, sell that. So I do need stone, unfortunately, for the uh, crystallariums. So let's snag that. Yeah, I need to be buying like a lot of stone from Robin eventually as well. Uh, so the crystallariums will definitely help with the money deficits though because I want to sit here and just make like a massive like diamond farm over here uh, so so far so good really I mean wow cool awesome all right so let's grab the diamonds that I have saved up And what I'll do is I'll actually just keep a couple and sell the rest. Um, I do need to go out and see Clint eventually as well after he's finished with my axe. So I can crack up and open all of these geodes I've got saved up. Alright, just go ahead and put everything else back in there. Yeah, that, uh, that took up a lot of um, stone, unfortunately. So... Ugh, stone. Yeah, that's what I need money for. I kind of forgot. I was like, what else did I need money for? Stone. Because <laughs> I just, like, kind of got wiped out there. Uh, so, let's uh, sell the diamonds. And then run into town. Take care of business. Oh, I need to chop down that tree. Although, I don't have my axe. Huh. I hope all those trees in our tree farm also grow before the season is up. The uh, slime hunter, huh? Okay, yeah, I can do that too. So, Gus, what time does the saloon open? 12? 11? Sure, why not? <laughs> I think I'm pretty good friends with Gus to come back here. All right, uh, yes. So, here you go, pal. Here's a little something for your trouble. No problem. Friend. All right. 60 gold. Well, not a lot, but whatever. <laughs> Better than nothing. Uh, yeah, and eventually I'll kind of have to try in my hand at the arcade games in there as well, but I'm so bad at them. I think it just takes a lot of practice. All right. Donate to museum. Actually have something to donate this time. Uh, 
So, I mean, I'm kind of keeping everything like in order, like next, you know, like things next to one another. Uh, yeah, so it doesn't look like I have the golden mask. I thought I got one of those forever ago. Oh, maybe that was something that dropped out of my inventory when I died. So yeah, I have to go out to the desert and do some digging out there eventually. Um, so let's see here. Pierre's is next on the agenda. And what did I say that I needed? I needed wheat and, oh, sunflower seeds. Oh, sorry, Ab Abigail. Uh, wasn't it her birthday? Like, I don't, somebody's birthday was coming up. Uh, okay, so, so sunflower seeds. And wheat. Since the wheat only takes four days, yeah, that's going to be um, the primary crop after everything starts uh, coming in. So, um, let's see. Oh, gosh. You know what? I should, well, mm, I was going to check this, uh, the price of the catalog, actually, because uh, if I can afford it, I might get it. Because I think it's like only 30000 Yeah going for it. Awesome. All right, cool. So the catalog is super nice because it's essentially just like instantaneous, like, uh, wallpaper and everything. So I can start decorating the house to how I want it to look. Might as well as pop in Robin, see what it, she needs and how much money she needs for the final upgrade. Cause that'll help with money. Uh, so upgrade house. Oh God. hundred thousand. Um, Lord. Okay, so can't afford it. Uh, construct farm buildings. 10,000 gold. That's not bad. I actually have all of this material. So I wonder if I can get back out here before she closes up shop. I think she typically closes at four or something. So... Uh, well, if I drink coffee, that'll make sprinkles run a little bit faster, too. So, let's go ahead and do that. I'm really excited to try out my new sword, too. Like, uh, oh, yeah, I gotta go over here. So, iridium and... Okay, put that up. Uh, so I need, like, ten of these. And, oh my god, where's all my iridium? <gasps> I don't have any iridium bars smelted. I must have used them all. Wow, I didn't realize. Well, heck. Okay, so the slime hutch is not happening today because there's no way that that is going to uh, get finished smelting before she's done. So, I guess... um. I'll just kind of stay in for the rest of the day, do some decorating, uh, put up my seeds since I don't need them. Okay, so, all right. Hi, Elliot. All right, put the, um, the catalog down. Actually, you know what? It doesn't really matter. I'll just put it in here for now. Um, okay. So, question is, how do I want this place to look? Like, I <laughs> always go through, like, massive amounts of wallpaper and flooring just deciding what I want everything to look like. Um, so, yeah, it's always a good idea for me to snag this stuff. So, I'm kind of thinking I would like a stone for the kitchen, but I don't know if I want the big stuff or the little stuff. Actually, probably the little stuff because it's got a little bit of greenery around the top. Uh, well, so does that. So we'll see which one I like best. Uh, wallpaper. So let's do the nursery and like green polka dots. Uh, and the flooring. Gosh. Um, okay. Well, let's see what looks best over here first. 
Not too shabby. Oh, I like that a lot too, though. Hmm. I think I kind of like the smaller bricks better. Yeah, see, that's why I always get the catalog before I start investing in wallpaper. Because, <laughs> like, once you put it up, um, that's it. It, uh, it spends it, essentially, and, uh, you can't get it back. So, oh, and this one kind of makes it look like there are bookshelves, so maybe I'll do that for the other room. I don't know. Uh, can I have a, a bit of a library up there? So, small bricks... Oh, whoops. Oh, what did I just do? Uh, oh, I just grabbed the tortillas on accident. Okay. Oh, God, I did it again. Uh, yeah, I like the smaller bricks better. Hmm. Okay, so I think I'm going to do this as a bedroom. I typically really like that wallpaper and how it looks. We'll see. Might change it eventually. Uh, living room. Probably would. Yeah, because I kind of like doing the, like, the farmhouse shabby chic look in my houses. So, uh, all right, so let's see how this looks up here. I don't know if I'm going to like it or not. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. So I might actually put the TV, end up putting the TV in there. Uh, this window needs to go. God, it's like 900. I'm like, uh, but I can't sell them, so, uh, or at least I'm pretty sure I can't. I can't put them in the, um, this looks like Christmas decor, too, so I'll take this down. Uh, and put it in here, even though I'll need to take it out pretty soon. Uh, yeah, and I've got, like, a sculpture and everything, so, I mean, I've got quite a bit of things to decorate the house with, so. But I do kind of want to put the TV in here, kind of make this the entertainment area. Um, so kind of out of the way. I don't know. I don't know if I like the books and how they look. Um, so let's see here. So yeah, I'll just go ahead and kind of experiment and then I'll show you guys what I come up with. Okay. All right, I'm done <laughs> for now. Um, I might change things around in the future, but for now, I think this looks pretty good. Um, I went with the vertical uh, flooring for the main parts of the house and then um, the, or I'm sorry, horizontal and then vertical over here. Oh, and I wonder, um, I think I can actually color that little strip over there. So let me grab that because um, I don't think I can actually change the flooring in Elliot's part of the main bedroom. Uh, I guess I'll just grab an extra one just in case, but I don't, uh, I, I really don't think that I can. I think I could just, oh no. Yeah, I can't. I can't even change this part. Okay. Well, it is what it is. <laughs> um, all right. So I'm going to hop into bed, call it a night. And I'm going to call it an episode as well. I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Please hit that like button. If you did, it always helps support the channel every time you do so. And subscribe if you're new here. Uh, ring the notification bell to be alerted whenever I go live or post new content. Uh, and until next time, take care, guys.